Hey guys, it's me Larry, and today we're going to Turkey. Hey guys, I'm back again and I'm um, very sorry if I've not been posting for a very long time. It's just um, college has been very busy and I also have my other responsibilities to take care of. So because of the current outbreak, um, we don't have school anymore uh, for the semester and I thought I could take this time for me to edit my videos because I still have a lot of vlogs that I haven't edited. Um, I think the last vlog I edited was the one I went to Los Angeles two years ago. But I have a lot more stories for me to share to you. So for the time being, I can start first with our family trip in Turkey, which is about a year ago. We thought about going to Turkey because I suggested it and I, can, I, can, I kept seeing it in social media that there are a lot of beautiful things in Turkey and like the hot air balloons, the caves even. Um, said to be part of Asia and Europe. So um, eventually we found a tour that was exactly during Holy Week and we took the tour going to Turkey. So for this vlog series, I'll be mainly talking about our experience there and the places we went to, the food that we because there's a lot of food selections actually in Turkey. Um, so most of my vlogs for Turkey will be um, there will be parts that I'll be intervening because there are some opportunities that I wasn't able to really physically vlog during that time because of because um, it was very busy and very cramped in the area where we went. So um, this was an eight day, seven night trip. And yeah, on our first day of our trip, we left Manila at around Saturday night by the Turkish Airlines. So our first stop was actually not in Istanbul but in Izmir but we took a direct flight from Manila to Istanbul and then um, a layover toward Izmir. The funny thing is that it took us about 14 hours from Manila to Turkey but um, we had a layover supposedly for an hour to our connecting flight to Izmir but unfortunately our flight was delayed in Metro Manila so even our connecting flight to Izmir was also um, delayed. Not really delayed, but the plane really left us. So we were stressed and we had to rebook our tickets on the spot and then to get on the next plane 15 minutes after we arrived in Turkey. Very stressful, very stressful. So we're finally here at our connecting flight. Um, we had to change flights because the original flight that we were supposed to board actually we already left and our flight from Manila was delayed so but it's been stressful yeah. and our tour hasn't even started so. so we are finally at Ishmir after 17 pretty some hours in the plane just finding our baggage room which is very far from where we were dropped off and, but eventually arrived in Izmir and we had our first lunch at the Artemis restaurant. So um, this restaurant was it's our first meal now and it was a, actually a very excellent meal because it was the first time we ate Turkish food. Um, we had some bread, tomato soup, um, Turkish kebab, basically full meal. Um, we also had a little bit of wine tasting in there so they, they were like very different versions of wine they're like boysenberry wine blackberry wine um, strawberry wine so yeah it's very um, it's a very fulfilling experience just for having the first meal um, being able to experience it immediately so after a meal we went off to FS or officials because this was um, like part of the and it said to be one of the first civilizations first cities actually um, present during that time We're now here at the ruins of Ephesus. So this is the entrance. We're gonna go in now.
Then after Ephesus, um, well, Ephesus was the only place that we went for the day because we arrived in Turkey in the morning, um, and then we had our lunch, and then we had to go to Ephesus in the afternoon. So after our Ephesus trip, um, we were already brought into our accommodation, and we were really surprised by this hotel because it was located near a cliff. And you can see how you can see like the agency, the beaches, the beach houses that the Turkish people live in during summer. And we were checked in into this um, hotel called Suhan 360. It's really a nice hotel. So this is our accommodation for today. Mm -hmm. This is actually a very nice accommodation. It's actually five stars. So it's Suwan Hotel 360. It's actually near the agency uh, of the outskirts of Ishmael. So this is our room. This is room 819. First we have this bathroom. Actually big. Has a shower. Of course sink and a toilet. We have a cabinet. This is also the mini bar. So there's actually complimentary water. Then we have the water kettle. And we also have the refrigerator here, which has some complimentary stuff. But it's actually for sale. And then we have here the bed itself. We have two twin beds. And then we also have some chair, lounge chairs here. And then there's also direct access to the pool. That's it for day one of our Turkish tour. So I was very tired already at the end of the day and I didn't really have the time to close the vlog. So I'm closing it now. So I hope you liked the video and um, stay tuned for my next videos in the coming days. So yeah, hope you liked the video and subscribe. Bye!